Hey everyone, this is Potato Couch and Michael. Welcome back to Nero Tamata 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 your girlfriend was just there She's earlier this week. She's still there. She's still there presently in the week. And also earlier this week. Yes. There, oh, there is a... <laughs> there is a... Oh, she's not... Oh. So what do you think? Oh, she's probably sleeping. Okay, whatever. <laughs> you want to call me not, it's totally okay. Well, a time-space hole opened up, and not only is she presently there right now, but she's also presently there in the past. Oh. Okay. <laughs> That's how time works. You say so, Mr. Time Man. Time is not linear. It's flat. We just experience it one second at a time. What do you mean it's flat? Isn't something mean flat still on the line? I don't understand. What do you mean? Okay, like... Isn't there more dimensions to time if it's flat? Uh, it's oh. an entire plane. No. Listen. I don't Imagine you would throw up. <laughs> life is a page in a book. Okay. Now, all the words on that page exist simultaneously, but you read them one at a time. Multiple resistance that's that's how we experience time. All the seconds exist simultaneously, but we read them one at a time. That's a theory, right? It is just a theory. A world theory. Uh, Thanks uh, for watching. <laughs> I don't even know the thing. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, that's what I'm talking I probably saw it months before you did. Because you weren't allowed to watch it. Yeah. Until, spoilers for Doki Doki Literature Club, by the way. As soon as that happened, you were allowed to see stuff. Did you watch that video? I, what the um, hell? Uh, I mean, Monica sent you earlier. Uh, yeah. Pretty good, right? I listened to it in the shower. I listened to it in the shower today. No. No. <laughs> as beautiful as Nate wants to battle's voice is. No. I was thinking about the thought of Monica. No. Also, Andrew Stein has a Doki Doki Literature Club song called Virus. And Christina V did a cover of Your Reality. That, uh, earlier in this playthrough, in the first episode, actually, I mentioned Christina V did a cover of a song from a video game that we were playing, but I didn't want to tell you what game because it would spoiled the thing. Now I can tell you. It, it's that song. It's your reality from Doki Doki Literature Club. It's... Okay. This uh, to, be hard. to be completely honest with you, she made a metal. To be completely God, honest it. with you... I'd rather listen to the original version of, of your reality. Because Christina V did like a rock cover of it, and it didn't translate well, in, in my opinion. Speaking of Christina V. I've only shown you the first episode of Madoka Magica, haven't I? Yeah. She has a voice in that show. Oh. She's the voice of Homura Akemi. She's a character in the show. I, you know what? You and I need to sit down and watch that show all the way through. It's a very easy show to get through in one day. It's only like three hours long in total. Because it's got like 13, 20 minute episodes. Yeah. So. And, uh, and three movies. Which, we could watch the three movies, like, instead of the show. I don't know how much is condensed. It takes about the same amount of time to watch. Like, if you were to watch the movies, or watch the show, and then just the last movie, it would take about the same amount of time. I hate this part so much. It all depends on what you'd rather have. 
Like, would you rather split it up by episode? Oh. Like, would you rather split it up by episode or by movie? Like, one gives you fewer pee breaks than the other. <laughs> Which is a deal breaker for me. It's trying to hack us. If we take hacking damage, it'll affect our bodies as well. I do. I'm very self-conscious about it. <laughs> Two piece. Like, I, no I noticed over the past <laughs> couple days at work that I go to... I go to pee more frequently than the other guys, and it's like, I am becoming aware of this. Are we seriously being attacked with dead androids? Oh, yeah, dang it. I don't think uh, Michael! Sorry. I almost called you Clay. <laughs> oh, sorry. You screw up so much less than he does. <laughs> Watch this episode. <laughs> I was just very mean there. <laughs> Clay, if you watch this episode, I'm You're sorry. Bitch. That too, but also I'm sorry. Kind of. <laughs> I mean, I feel remorse for what I said. If you can count that as being sorry. <laughs> no, go ahead. He has been a naughty boy. I'm a very naughty spank me daddy. <laughs> <laughs> the the, you know, that's the interesting thing about um, spank me. Keep it busy. You go. No. The English language, uh, the, like the distinction between, um, well, no, I, I'm, I'm sorry, Father, I've done something wrong, and, and spank and, and, and sorry, Daddy, I've been a bad girl, or I've been naughty. Um, also, uh, the difference between a butt dial and a booty call. Saturation attack triggered by enemy consciousness data. Uh, Failure to destroy one. it quickly may lead to also, serious damage um, in memory regions. Also, like, if I invite you out to my cottage in the forest, that's just a good time in a comfortable environment. If I invite you to my cabin in the woods, I am upholstering my furniture with your skin. I think that's what it is. Yeah. But still, I mean, you know, all of them have something to do with something else. It's just the way that the language developed. It's the way all languages develop, really. Things have things, something to do with something else. That's how homophones and homophones and synonyms. Homophones and synonyms my favorite flavor. This morning for breakfast, I had synonym toast crunch. I did. <laughs> I ignored it. But damn it, <laughs> you brought it back up. <laughs> well, I was going for another joke. Tiny Michael, you clayed. You clayed it. <laughs> Drew too much attention to the joke. <laughs> it didn't land. I think it landed and just landed somewhere else. <laughs> it just landed over there. Joke, get back here. What the hell are you doing over there? That is not where I sent you. <laughs> Like now see what I don't understand about the Spanish that. language is papi. Papi is is some some little kids called. Ah uh, I man, I guess it makes sense. Yeah. Little kids called dad. Daddy. Yeah, it's like a child calling their father calls, daddy or a woman calling her boyfriend daddy. Sometimes it's not sexual. I've noticed. And uh, an adult says it. But it's not as like sexual as English. Yeah. Because when you're like, I'm your daddy. Oh my gosh, uh, she's a spider lady. Oh, she oh gosh, a, she's a spider lady with a weird vagina. Yeah, pee pee. Oh, Robots a, do pee out her butt. She's a trap. <laughs> or, think, a, or a or a food out of her ass. <laughs> she's either a trap or a food out. Stay tuned out. to find out. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> We're going fuck her. What? Right? No, I'd rather not for this one. No, I think like, I'm into I'm hand hand. into some weird hentai, but like this is a little far. When worms start coming out of it, you've gone too far. Reminds me of that one episode that we did in Killer is Dead. Ooh, she cute. She got a worm coming out of her ass. Did that episode ever come out? Yeah. God, we abandoned that game like a sack of potatoes. Go! Which, by the way, is how we were all born. We were abandoned as young spuds. In a sack of potatoes. Oh, she's in love with a mailman. 
your book robot just slaughtered her. She's super dead. Now we'll never know if she was a trap or a fuda. Excuse me, was that? Thanks for the assist. Was that girl, penis? Oh, you mean the hacking? <laughs> or was it a No boy? worries. Us scanners are pretty good at that kind of thing. I've got your back anytime. I'm sorry. I think they were only being kept alive. Oh. Il Retea? Retae? Who's Il Retae? Heather Lee. Oh! <laughs> then we'll have to bleep that. Sorry. <laughs> so, um. What is it? That machine had some pretty bleep weird things one, to though. say, huh? It's almost like it had actual emotion. The machines don't have feelings. You said that yourself. Yeah, I. I guess. Type the controls. Okay. The controls. You know are all taken. the controls, right? Um, jump. Uh, slash. Uh, big slash. Uh, what is the the B button doesn't do nothing. Okay. Almost spiral controls. I am not hostile. Huh? You defeated broken machine. Yes. I am your savior. This thing is awfully Batman verbose for a machine. We repay you. To our village. All right, I'll go. It could be a trap. Still, <laughs> no, we killed the trap. And gather data, right? <laughs> oh, nines, you silly boy. You are a boy, yes? This way. This way. So, Dr. Michael posits. Dang it. The, this way. There are no colors. If 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 Dr. Michael posits that robots pee pee out their buckles, but Dr. Tio posits that maybe they don't pee pee out their buckles. Maybe robots don't pee pee at all. It is entirely possible that robot biology uses everything it takes in and generates no waste. It is entirely possible that the robot biology does not generate waste and in fact uses everything that it puts into its body. Have you ever seen a robot pee pee? I haven't. No, granted, I haven't watched robots very thoroughly and unfortunately I don't have very many mechanical American What's friends. That? Oh, right. But you wouldn't have um, seen that before. They're sending supplies up from Earth of, to the you know, moon. Most and above. people, I think, just assume no that robots are fuel in space after all. Huh. Um, but you know, I think that some study needs to be done. Yes, we need to dedicate resources to an actual study as to whether or not robots pee. Don't ask one. No, don't ask a robot that you see on the street if it pees. Like, you don't know if that's gonna set him off if he thinks that's like a, so like a microaggression or whatever. The aliens who created them attack the bunker directly. They originally um, came here from outer space, right? So, well, like, there are a few theories just about that, don't but no confront sure. them about their Hard to tell what an alien is thinking, you know? Except in, like, a study. Like, in study form, like, hey, I need to know if you pee pee. They're gonna be like, what? You're gonna be like, yeah, I need to study your pee pee. And and if they tell you they don't pee pee, then you mostly have your answer, but like, do it anyway. You know, it might be a fun experiment. I've been rambling on about robotic urine for longer than it's healthy, I think. But look, they're all surrendering. Did I win? I think I won. It's really too bad Michael couldn't have, you know, been here for the end of the series. Welcome to the finale, everyone. I won the game. They're all waving their white flags. They surrendered. They gave up. They're cowards. They all have white flags. This is the real like world equivalent of disconnecting from from your Street Fighter fight uh, when you take a hit. Okay, yeah, I'll talk to you, I guess. Hey. Before we begin, there's something you must understand. Okay. We are not your enemies. Uh, to be! 
We can't trust anything the machines say. Oh, just calm your, cool your jets, racist. That's a boy's name. You have a girl voice. Oh, that sounds boring. I live a life of adventure. And, and slaying bitches and hoes. <laughs> Talk to me, buddy. We will not fight. Cool. So it'll be easy to kill you. Um, save. This is what Michael's been doing, right? God, I hope so. I haven't been paying attention. I don't even actually know how to play this game. <laughs> I'm really glad I'm in a non-combat section, because I have no idea what I'm doing. Dude, the thing just glowed at me. I should probably be reading the things that pop up on the screen when stuff like that happens. It's really late. Towards the screen, she looked at it, she's like, I can't jump out of this. Yeah. Oh, oh. So, um, I came to a conclusion about your thesis as to whether or not robots pee pee out their buttholes. Oh, yeah? Yeah. What's your conclusion? You'll have to watch the video oh, yeah. to find out, which you have to do because you edit these. Yeah. Do what? She painted her face like a whore. <laughs> Yeah, I went out the front porch, or on the por front porch, and I went to come back in, and I felt something brush against my leg. I was like, oh, fuck. I looked down, and Dool's just, it wasn't Dool's chilly. just, she's not running, she's <laughs> walking towards the edge of the porch, looked out and saw the screen, and she looked back at me, saw there wasn't a screen next to me, and she was like, I'm gonna fucking run. <laughs> and I was like, no, the fuck, you're not, and I jumped on her. So you, felt, the, you felt a brush scrub. against your leg and realized it wasn't chilly? Yeah, I picked her up on a scrub for her neck and I was like, you coming with me, you little bitch? Yeah. She's like, yeah, I don't. I don't know. She, did, she didn't even cry. Alright. <laughs> She's like, dang. Aww. You're such a sweet baby and you're stupid and you're a cat and you're going to hell when you die, but... Anyways. I jump boy. Is that all she was going to say? Cool. Please be calm. You are not your enemy. They all chose uh, French names, I assume. So. Waving the flag is fun. <laughs> we are French after all. <laughs> <laughs> and the flag is white. <laughs> yes, that's the, that is the joke. That's that's the joke. <laughs> hey, dude, you know if you get outside, there's no food. We are not your enemy. There's no food outside. She's a cat, she can kill her food. No, she can. But she's gonna die and be someone else's food. Is the white flag means we surrender? Chili's gonna beat you up. Chili's a cat that lives outside. We are not your enemy. I'm just gonna say the same thing. Don't even say it because I'm, I'm creative. We are not your. Okay, you know what? This is getting repetitive. This is weird. Why don't you just go home? Stop recording. Go home. <laughs> Go to bed. That, that, that was the funniest thing about her getting out. Yep. She didn't do it quickly. She just kind of walked past me like, excuse me. Where am I going? <laughs> excuse me, I won't go outside. She's done that. You have work in the morning. What are you doing? Two times here? already. Before. You have, have other lessons. You have to work in the morning. What are you doing here? Why are you still here? Go home. Get to sleep. You have work in the morning. So do I. Full time job now. Same job, for sure. I'm a uh, five, four, three, two, 
one. Who does for 20 minutes? I think the episode's over. Okay. Um. Jumpy. 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 Ah!